With the exception of Clark's migraine, I thought the evening was mercifully uneventful. What's wrong? Nothing. Helen, if we're going to spend our lives together, we need to be completely honest with each other. You're always saying that. I found a file on Mrs. Kent in your bookshelf. It contained confidential medical records from my office. I got that from one of the disease control agents who was investigating Mrs. Kent's case. You mean you bribed someone for it? I've told you. The Kents are very important to me. I was concerned about Martha's health. What were you looking for, anyway? Something that was stolen from my office. Do you think I was involved in the break-in? Please tell me you weren't. If you really believe I'm capable of that kind of deceit, maybe you shouldn't be marrying me. Maybe you're right. I had to pry it from his hand. It wasn't your fault, Clark. The man tried to kill you. He was delusional. Even the sheriff agreed, son. Walden was responsible for his own death. What if he was right? What if I am some sort of threat to mankind? I'll never believe that. And neither should you. Well, then what does it mean? The day is coming when I'll begin my quest to rule? We don't know, son. But when and if that day does come, your mother and I both know that you will do the right thing. His entire body's been burnt beyond recognition. Mm. <laughs> but, look. Whatever he was holding here, it completely protected the skin it was covering. seen anything like this. Send it to me. <laughs> Sent you what? The hand. <laughs> <laughs> 